Deal. Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to make Epicure's 15 minutes cauliflower soup. Um, so I have a multi pot here, which I um, simmered five cups of prepared vegetable bouillon. Um, of course, Epicure's vegetable bouillon is this jar. This jar gives you about 32 cups of um, prepared bouillon. Um, and hence has only 40 milligrams of sodium per cup. So for those that are looking for a low sodium alternative, um, this would be it. We also have a chicken beef uh, or chicken bouillon, which um, has 100 milligrams of sodium per cup, as well as a beef bouillon, which has 60 milligrams per cup. So um, these are the three ingredients that I'll be using for the soup. So Epicure's vegetable bouillon, um, Epicure's seasoning for roasted garlic aioli, um, awesome um, alternative for garlic powder or garlic salt um, but has a wonderful recipe here to make a um, garlic sauce to put in your sandwiches or uh, along as a salad and I will also be using Epicure's Paris Bistro so in here there is two tablespoons of the Paris Bistro along with um, um, a quarter cup of water and I'm going to be adding um, two tablespoons of olive oil into that mixture and I will let it sit while I prepare my soup. Um, so two tablespoons of um, olive oil is mixed to this wonderful um, sauce. Uh, this Paris Bistro is one of my favorites. It's a mix sorry, of onions and garlic um, in there. So um, while that is prepped, I went ahead so the video won't last too long and uh, got my base ready. So I used Epicure's 12 cup multi pot. As you can see in this pot, you have it in cups and liters with a pour spout um, and comes with a wonderful um, lid, um, which in the lid you have the incorporated um, strainer attached. So this is a wonderful pot for those that are campers. Um, by any means, I did put five cups of Epicure's uh, bouillon and I added a head, a medium head of um, cauliflower here and you would be able to use it as a blender since I don't own a blender and have um, a multi-purpose um, one I'm going to be using my um, food processor so um, in there there's um, five cups again of uh, vegetable bouillon with a medium head of cauliflower which um, we will be blending in the pot um, and I will um, be um, adding sorry a teaspoon of um, Epicure's roasted garlic AOE to this mix okay for flavor um, so again this wonderful AOE and this is optional if you choose to add milk or cream it is your choice um, I'm going to be using approximately three-quarter cup of um, milk but you could use what you wish um, in your recipe and you could completely omit it and I'm just going to um, blend it and I um, So this is blended um, to my liking. Um, so I have a, a nice uh, cauliflower uh, base, and I'm going to use um, sorry Epicure's um, ladle here for the soup, um, just so I can show you what uh, the bowl will actually look like. It's a little hot for me to take that middle part out, so. Um, excuse me if it's taking a little time so you would fill your your bowl of soup up and um, you could actually just drizzle this on top as a um, decoration for your soup bowl using the Paris Bistro so just a quick re recap in this wonderful bowl which was drizzled on the top of the soup is Epicure's Paris Bistro you could have used uh, Epicure's uh, secret sauce Taj or the El Dorado which is an Italian or uh, Mexican blend um, in this sauce there's actually a quarter cup of water with two tablespoons of oil um, for the soup all I did was use Epicure's 12 cup multi pot added five cups of prepared vegetable bouillon um, simmered that for about 15 minutes passed it in the blender and added 
um, a teaspoon of the roasted garlic aioli and boom, my soup is done and or puree done within 15 minutes. I hope you enjoy and um, if you have any further questions, feel free to contact me.